Covington High School Ag Department uh, was awarded a grant that a student had written several years ago. It's a uh, combined effort between the agricultural department here and the engineering department. Treating me as a client, they came out, interviewed me, what did I want, what did I expect, what was, that, was, what, what was going to be the outcome. Through the grant, we, we had enough monies to buy the material to do a drip irrigation system, which is much more efficient. We're not ag students, we're um, strictly engineering students, the most of us. Um, so it was a bit difficult to gauge our plan from just straight from the classroom. So we had to kind of just check it mathematically and see if it was even possible. And we figured out we needed a little bit more materials, some more drip hose than what we had. So we tried to make a plan based on that. Uh, we also had to ensure that this pa these paths were still walkable, so that was something that we had to take into account. From there, we tried to figure out how much we extra we needed, um, and once we figured that out, then we fully fleshed out our plan. Because we're using drip hoses, not necessarily sprinklers, there, there was no waste. Um, just making sure that we closed off everything, everything was tightened, would just mitigate any, any problems with water pressure or waste. The best part about what we're doing out here, and especially with cl other classes here at Covington High School, is we're getting those students out of the classroom and putting their hands to work. It's nice getting out of the classroom and being able to um, come do something hands-on, and bonus of that was actually being able to help the Ag Department. I think it really helps our school community and um, just all of our experience as a whole. They knocked it out of the park, without a doubt.